Hello viewers, welcome to yet, yet another session. In this session, we are going to install Oracle 18C in Oracle Linux 7.6 in the 64-bit OS. So let's begin. First, disable the firewall. It's already disabled. Now, make sure the firewall is off when you uh, restart okay, the same is happening now uh, make the AC Linux is equal to the disabled you can configure AC Linux otherwise but for the simplicity I am doing it uh, disabled here Disabled. Okay. Save it. Now, create OS groups. These are the commands uh, given here. You can uh, easily apply this. I'm creating the groups. Okay. Now change password of the. Oracle user. Now let's create the directories required and uh, keep the uh, change the ownership, provide the ownership to the Oracle user. Okay. okay. The directories have been created. Now what you will have to do, you will have to change and uh, etc host values. Okay. Okay, our job is almost done. Now, most important thing in pre-installation task is uh, now to uh, inst uh, install Oracle Database pre-installation RPM. So now let's do that. Uh, keep keep in mind that all these operations are done in root users so we will install yam install oracle database <laughs> okay pre-install 18c 64 bit now we are going to install it yes yes okay our pre-installation task has been complete now all the configuration from uh, root user is done now we'll have to log in as oracle and uh, change the batch profile okay let's go this you oracle vi dot batch profile is ready now our pre-installation task is ready now what we will have to do we will have to transfer our installation zip zip file that we have uh, downloaded from oracle site to this home folder this is the difference between oracle 12 and oracle 18 that in 12 keep the zip file anywhere but uh, in 18c you will have to unzip the oracle software in oracle home folder now we're going to transfer this one to the server okay now installation zip is transferred to the oracle home folder now let's unzip cd unzip now the installation file has been um, transferred to the uh, Oracle Home. So let's move to Oracle Home directory. Okay. 
let's see what is the yeah see run installer is here now we will run the run installer command run installer command okay we'll select the option set up software only next single instant database installation okay next enterprise edition next oracle base and oracle location of here so one warning is here so it says physical memory so expect it is 8 gb but i have 5.5 gb here uh, you know it, it will work no problem but uh, recommended is at least 8 gb uh, because it's in uh, VM, I couldn't uh, afford to give much uh, RAM here. But in your production environment, it is a minimum 8 GB you have to do. But you, you know, in, in production environment, you're going to pro provide much more uh, memory in your server. But for, for this instance, it will work uh, just fine, I, I think. We're going to ignore it. Now, next. Yes. Install. installation has begun okay now we will have to run this do to escape from root user Now our software is installed. I remember software is installed. Now database has not been in, uh, created yet. We will create database with Oracle DBCA. So let's run DBCA. Create a database. Name is Oracle Warcell. Okay, now okay. create a continent database and pluggable database. We're going to create a pluggable database. Let's pdb1. Okay, its name is pdb1. Now, next. It's called the password. No problem. I am given a simple password. You will provide a strong password here. And database creation create uh, started yes database creation is complete close now let's uh, connect to the database let's see if it is uh, actually where is the database SQL plus yes we're connected now uh, alter session Set container uh, equal to pdb one. Order now we are in, in the portable database one. A. Thank you for watching. Thank you everybody.